we are going to cross over now to our reporter Sam Kele Maseko, who is at the Alberton Police Station, where a senior ANC member handed himself over to the police. Sam Kele, good morning. So, um, following evidence presented at the State Capture Commission of Inquiry, is that what this is related to? Yes, uh, indeed. Uh, a senior member of uh, the African National Congress, uh, a former member of parliament uh, who chaired the Correctional Services uh, Portfolio Committee in the fourth administration and in the fifth administration co-chaired the various land uh, debates uh, that were taking place across uh, the country land consultations in the amendment of Section 25 of the Constitution, did hand himself over to the Alberton, uh, Alberton Police Station this morning at about half past eight. He has just left this particular uh, police station and uh, heading over to the Palm Ridge Magistrates Court, where you will effectively apply for uh, bail uh, today. And we also do know that uh, his legal team was alongside him here. This comes after the revelations at the State Capture Commission of Inquiry that uh, this particular former chairperson of the Correctional Services Portfolio Committee had an alleged uh, corrupt uh, relationship uh, with African Global Operations, formerly trading as Busasa. We do know that uh, these revelations have been coming out of the State Capture Commission of Inquiry and the Investigative Directorate, which is effectively the new Scorpions, is uh, sitting in these uh, particular hearings and is uh, taking down notes on whatever uh, criminal uh, in, 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 testimony that may be taking place and that is admissible in the court of law and has effectively decided to charge this particular former member of parliament and senior leader of the African National Congress. One may state that this leader does not sit in any decision-making structure of the governing party at this point in time is a former member of parliament but was in a highly influential position in the various administrations in parliament. And uh, just a quick one, Samkele, before we go, uh, are there any other further arrests expected with regard to Busasa-related evidence uh, that was led at the State Capture Commission? Yes, indeed. It seemingly does look like there are more arrests that will be done in the coming weeks when it comes to the relations of uh, Busasa and uh, now trading as African Global Operations and the relations or financial relations that they've had with various politicians of the governing party. But it does look as if the investigative directorate and the Hawks are going to be very busy in the coming weeks sweeping a number of uh, politicians and those government officials who've been linked to working with African Global Operations. So much our reporter Sam Kele Maseko, who's out in Alberton and uh, politician handing himself over. This is what people have been asking. When do we see politicians being arrested for all of the uh, corruption allegations that we've heard, at, especially at the State Capture Commission of Inquiry?